Hello dear students, so I'm going to uh, talk about, explain uh, this passage, young women, young women changing the world. So there is a website uh, called take part, means share, engage, or participate. So it's a website, uh, there, there is uh, the following article, there is an article uh, from this website. So what does this website do? So it accumulates or gathers news, photos, and videos about today's issues and suggests actions people can take around uh, the world to make a change. So this website shows uh, pictures, uh, let's say photos, videos of the problems around the world and tell you uh, or let's say gives you, uh, let's say an overall idea how to make a change. So if you just open the website, you will find the problems uh, available there, and you can volunteer or uh, make a diff uh, sorry uh, participate to make a, a difference. So they give you the idea how to or the suggestion how to uh, make a difference. So this website also uh, provides stories of people who are working for change locally, nationally, and globally, and it also gives. Uh, or provides the stories around the world of people who have uh, made some changes so there are problems and they ask you to help and there are problems who are solved by some people so let's say locally and uh, let's say in our city or community nationally around uh, let's say Kurdistan and globally around the world so the first team is the socket team so the second team by Jessica Lynn, Jessica O. Matthews, uh, Julia uh, Silverman, and Himali Thacker, uh, they made a great idea. So they are Harvard students. They made a great idea. Uh, so this is uh, this is the team. These are the ladies who made this uh, ball. So this is the ball. So they dribble. They use their feet to move the or control the ball. So it can charge uh, electricity when they use the ball to play the game, to play soccer, and they can make uh, even uh, sorry the the ball can charge uh, electricity and uh, uh, let's say make a light. So this is how it works. Okay, so renewable energy so renewable it means that energy that uh, lasts forever so not depleted okay in most african countries more than 90 percent of the population lives without electricity there is no electricity and it is a big problem and if you go to africa there are so many kids young uh, people who play football uh, or soccer in the American uh, accent it's called soccer so they play football whenever they have the chance every time they are free they play soccer so but it took four young women to realize that all the energy being used on the field can be used to power uh, people's homes they said uh, people or let's say children play football too much so what can we do to help these families so let's change these balls into something uh, something uh, let's say uh, that helps them so this they made a ball that uh, charges electricity so that energy was going in vain so nobody used the energy of these young uh, children so the magic magic soccer ball created by these harvard students uh, uh, is beautiful in its simplicity so why it is beautiful not it is in its shape or the way you look at the ball no in its simplicity if the socket captures it's very simple the idea is very simple there is a dynamo inside the ball that moves this is sorry this is the dynamo uh, so there is a small machine inside the ball that moves so when it moves it captures electricity it saves electricity this is very simple so the socket so if you have an idea about socket so this is the socket this is socket plug okay so soccer 
is uh, football in the American accent. So socket means socket, and uh, what do we <laughs> can say? So both are uh, put together: the the socket, the plug of electricity, and soccer. Okay. So how that water, how uh, the ball captures energy or takes energy or saves energy from kick dribble so when they move the ball with the feet and controls it and throw it and kicks it uh, from one uh, person to another so it stores the energy kids can play a game then bring the ball home so they when they are finished with the uh, ball sorry with soccer they can take the ball home and let uh, sorry uh, uh, sorry to charge the uh, LED lamps cell phones or battery so they no longer you uh, need to use unhealthy and expensive kerosene uh, so because they don't have electricity they use old lamps with gas uh, and it is not healthy they, it is expensive because they buy kerosene they buy uh, uh, let's say gas and they don't have enough money so sometimes they walk three hours to charge their phones and it is uh, very hard for them so down the line so later the founders hope the socket ball will move beyond single family homes so they think it is uh, now the ball is for single families but in the future the power uh, sorry they need to power hospitals and schools using uh, another maybe notion or idea not the ball of course another idea or notion to uh, make electricity for hospitals and schools in Africa but think of the immediate impact so there is a very uh, let's say instant or fast uh, effect impact the ball can have on individual kids so there is an instant or very uh, fast change in the lives of these kids when they use this uh, socket ball how money is saved they don't buy kerosene uh, families can afford to send their children to school when they don't uh, let's say spend money on kerosene uh, they can send their children to school and when they send their children to school children do not uh, go to work so ch child labor decreases goes down and better word emerges when uh, students sorry when children go to school and uh, they don't work they can make their lives better so the second part is in the second video